వెల్కమ్ టు అవర్ యూట్యూబ్ ఛానల్ మ్యాథ్స్ బాలకృష్ణ సార్ నవ్ టుడే ఐఎమ్ ఎక్స్ప్లెయినింగ్ ది క్లాస్ ఎయిట్ చాప్టర్ వన్ రెసల్ నెంబర్ న్యూ సిలబస్ ఇన్ ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ ఓకే దిస్ ఇయర్ ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ గవర్నమెంట్ స్టార్ట్ న్యూ సిలబస్ దట్ ఈస్ ఎన్సీఆర్టీ సిలబస్ ఓకే సో హియర్ ఎక్ ఎక్సైజ్ వన్ పాయింట్ వన్ బిఫోర్ వీ గో టు ఎక్సైజ్ వన్ పాయింట్ వన్ ఫైన్ ఫస్ట్ నో అబౌట్ రేసల్ నెంబర్ రేసల్ నెంబర్ మీన్స్ వాట్ ఎ నెంబర్ విచ్ ఇస్ ఇన్ ద ఫార్మ్ ఆఫ్ పీ బై క్యూ ఓకే హియర్ ఎ నెంబర్ విచ్ ఇన్ ద ఫార్మ్ ఆఫ్ పీ బై క్యూ క్యూ ఈజ్ నాట్ ఈక్వల్ టు జీరో P and Q are integers. These numbers are called rational numbers. So, here, rational numbers are denoted by capital Q. Capital Q means what? Quotient number. A number which is divided by another number, we get the quotient. Okay, that numbers are called rational numbers. So, a number which is in the form of P by Q. Q is not equal to 0. P and Q are integers. If Q is equal to 0, it is not defined. It is a number. It is not a number. Okay. Any number divided by 0, it is undefined. Okay. So, this is the definition of rational number here. Before we go to exercise 1.1, example 1, find 3 by 7 plus minus plus of minus 6 by 11 plus of minus 8 by 21 plus 5 by 22. Okay. Here, how we can do that? Here, there is two methods are there. Here. In lower section, in 7th class, already you know, okay, the simplification of fractions, addition or subtraction of the fractions more than 2 or 2, okay, uh, how they either cross multiplication or taking the LCM of any two fractions or more than two fractions. Here, how many fractions are there? Four fractions. So, the four fractions denominator will take that LCM, then we can simplify. Otherwise, you can do that another ways also here. Observe the denominator here 7, 11, 21, 22. So, in the denominator, we can observe here the 7, here is 21. So, here 7 and 21 both are multiples of 7, 11 and 22 both are multiples of 11. Okay, so this one you can write as 3 by 7 plus of minus 6 by 11 plus of minus 8 by 21 plus 5 of 22. So, this one you can write as like this 3 by 7 plus minus 8 by 21 plus of minus 6 by 11 plus 5 by 22. So, here 7 and 21, okay, these two are multiples of 7, 11 and 22, these two are multiples of 11. So, here how we can do that? Take the denominator LCM. When you observe the denominator LCM on 7, 21, here what is the LCM? 21. Okay, these two are multiples of 7, the highest multiples of 7 is nothing but LCM. Okay, so the LCM of 7 and 21 is 21. Here, the denominator is 7, okay, we can multiply with 3, 7, 3, 3, 3, 9, plus, minus, 8, plus, here, 11, 22, here, these two are multiples of 11, okay, in these two, what is the highest multiple, 22, so 22 is the LCM, okay, here the denominator is 11, so we make the denominator is 22 means we can multiply with 2, okay, that is here, minus 6 into 2, okay, plus 5 into 1, okay, so that is here, 9, plus into minus, minus 8, 21, by minus 6 into 2, minus 12, plus 5 by 22, here 9 minus 8 that is 1 by 21 okay minus 12 plus 5 that is minus 7 by 22 again these two are here the here these two are fractions we can do that cross multiplication so 9 minus 8 1 by 21 minus 12 plus 5 that is minus 7 by 22 here plus into minus minus here these two are fractions we can do that cross multiple 1 into 22 22 next minus 7 into 21 minus 7 into 21 by 21 into 22 here 1 22 ja 22 plus into minus minus 7 21 ja 147 by 21 into 22 462 plus 22 minus 147 that is minus 125 by 462. So, the value of the given is how much minus 25 by 462. Find minus 4 by 5 into 3 by 7 into 5 by 16 into minus 14 by 9. So, this one you can do that more than two methods. 
okay here solution minus 4 by 5 into 3 by 7 into 15 by 16 into minus 14 by 9 so this one you can do that like this minus 4 by 5 into 3 by 7 into 15 by 16 so a into b is equal to b into a here the numbers are follow the six properties so natural numbers whole numbers ra integers rational numbers irrational numbers real numbers follow the six properties there are commutative property closure property associative property identity property inverse property distributive property under binary operations addition subtraction multiplication division okay here 3 by 7 into 15 by 16. 3 by 7 is a rational number, 15 by 16 is a rational number. So, A into B is equal B into A. So, 3 by 7 into 15 by 16 we can write as 15 by 16 into 3 by 7 into minus 14 by 9. Okay, here 5 1 ja, 5 3 ja, 4 1 ja, 4 4 ja. Next 3 1 ja, 3 3 ja, 7 1 ja, 7 2 ja, 3 3 cancel. So, next 2 1 ja, 2 2 ja. So here minus 1 into 1 into 1 into minus 1 by 1 into 2 into 1 into 1. So minus into minus plus here 1 by 1 to ja 2, 2 1 ja 2, 2 1 ja 2. So that is 1 by 2. So the value of this problem is 1 by 2. Next write the additive inverse of the following. Additive inverse. So here plus any integer having plus it is become minus minus plus into divide divide into so here inverse 82 inverse means a number is plus a number having plus sign its edit inverse is minus so here first one minus 7 by 19 okay the first one is minus 7 by 19 here we know that minus divided by plus that is minus plus divided by minus that is minus minus divided by minus that is plus plus divided by plus that is plus okay so here minus by plus it is become minus 7 by 19 for this number having 82 inverse so that is here 82 inverse of 82 inverse of minus 7 by 19 is plus 7 by 19 so when you adding these two we can get identity element the identity element is 0 okay 82 identity element is 0 multiple identity element is 1 so that is here minus 7 by 19 plus 7 by 19 is equal here these two are like fractions write the common denominator adding the numerator minus 7 plus 7 that is 0 by 19 0 by anything 0 second one 21 by 112 okay for this number having right additive inverse additive inverse means plus of a number right minus okay here minus plus okay multiple inverse means into divide divide into so here additive inverse additive inverse of 21 by 112 is minus 21 by 112 so here when you are adding these two we can get identity element so plus minus 21 by 12 so plus into minus minus 21 by 112 minus 21 by 112 so write the common denominator adding the numerators so that is here 0 by 112 0 by anything 0 0 by anything 0 example 4 verify that minus of minus x is equal to x before I am explaining this one, I want to explain another one is 82 inverse property. A number is adding to its inverse, we can get identity element. For suppose we take that 2 is number. For this 2, what is the additive inverse? Minus 2. Okay. So, the minus 2 is adding to plus 2. Here plus into minus, minus. 2 minus 2, 0. So, this property is called additive inverse property. So, here a plus minus a we can get 0 a is a number its additive inverse is minus a when you adding these two we can get 0 plus of minus a is going to rise order than minus so that is here a is equal to minus of minus a 
zero minus of minus a. We can get as minus of minus a. Okay, so here a is equal minus of minus a. The negative of a negative is positive. So here verify minus of verify that minus of minus x is equal x for x is equal 13 by 17 and x is equal minus 21 by 31. Okay, here x is equal 13 by 17. Here minus of minus x that is equal minus of minus 13 by 17. Here minus minus plus the negative rest number of a negative is positive. So that is here plus 13 by 17. So 13 by 17 nothing but what x. So minus of minus x is equal x. So next x is equal minus 21 by 31. Here minus by plus minus. 21 by 31 okay so here verify minus of minus x is equal minus of minus minus 21 by 31 minus minus plus minus of minus is plus minus of plus 21 by 31 minus into plus minus that is minus 21 by 31 minus 21 by 31 in nothing but x so this is the verification so minus of minus x is equal x here minus 13 by 17 is adding to its additive inverse here plus and minus minus 13 by 17 minus 13 by 17 so here both are like fractions write the common denominator 13 minus 13 so that is equal x is equal to minus 21 by 31 here 21 by 31 is adding to minus 21 by 31 plus and minus minus 21 by 31. So, here like fractions 21 minus 21 that is equal 0 by 31 that is equal 0. 0 by anything 0. Next example 5. Find 2 by 5 into minus 3 by 7 minus 1 by 14 minus 3 by 7 into 3 by 5. So, when you observe here first term and last term the denominators are 5 7 here 7 5. So, this problem we can do like this 2 by 5 into minus 3 by 7 minus 1 by 14 minus 3 by 7 into 3 by 5. Here, this one you can write as 2 by 5 into minus 3 by 7 minus 3 by 7 into 3 by 5. So, the minus we can write as product. How to can write minus into plus minus. Okay. So, here this one we can write as 2 by 5 into minus 3 by 7 plus of minus 3 by 7 into 3 by 5. Here plus into minus minus. In this two term what are the common 3 by 7. So, here which property can use here distributive property a into b plus a into c is equal a into of b plus c. So, that is here minus 3 by 7 is taking outside what the remaining 2 by 5 plus 3 by 5 minus 1 by 14 here 3 by 7 3 by 7 is common in this two term so minus 3 by 7 is taking our so the remaining 2 by 5 plus 3 by 5 these two are like fractions here minus 3 by 7 into 2 plus 3 by 5 minus 1 by 14 2 plus 3 5 so that is here minus 3 by 7 into 5 by 5 minus 1 by 14 5 1 ja 5 1 ja cancel so that is here minus 3 by 7 into 1 minus 1 by 14 so here any number is multiplied with 1 we get same it is which property multiple identity property so this one we can do that minus 3 by 7 minus 1 by 14 again these two are fractions we can take that by doing taking LCM or cross multiplication. So, that is here take the LCM here 7, 14 both are multiples of 7 ok 14 is highest multiple ok. So, here the denominator is 7 which make that 14 uh, means we can multiply the 2 ok minus 3 into 2 minus 1 into 1. So, 3 to ja 6 minus 1 by 14 minus 6 minus 1 minus 7 by 14 7 1 ja 7 2 ja that is minus 1 by 2. So, the value of this problem is minus 1 by 2. S subscribe our YouTube channel, we get more mathematics videos.